Hey YouTube, thanks for checking out my channel and today what I want to do is show you something that I've been working on with the moped. This thing here is an old bike trailer and I made it a cargo hauler. The reason that I'm showing you this is because I put it on my other channel, RV Daydream. If you want to check out that channel, it's basically about camping and, and camper and RV life. What I wanted to show you is what this thing looks like and talk about why I set it up. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and go over to that clip and let myself tell you what I've already told my other channel uh, all about that little trailer and why we got it and how nice it is. So for you moped guys, here you go. Whenever we go camping, we need to haul groceries and firewood and ice and stuff like that. And I can only do so much with these saddlebags. Um, there's some locks in there and stuff like that and some insurance papers. And of course this one here, <laughs> I could put a basket on the back or they even make a basket for the front, but really it's not gonna haul all the stuff that I wanted to. I'm gonna show you what we've got as far as a solution. It packs up real easily and flat and goes in the back of my truck. Of course this here we'll use as a container. And then this is a uh, little kid's bicycle carrier you know the type that hook on the back of the bicycle and it's got a little top to it and all that stuff and got seats in there and seat belts for the kids um, anyways the wheels just snap on they're nothing they just clip on they literally you just push them on and then the uh, trailer set up to be hooked up to the bike or to the moped and you can see I've got a bracket that's fabricated there that's on the back so let me go ahead and hook that up and I'll show you what it looks like all right, so there you go. You can see what the trailer looks like now. And of course, I've got bungee cords and hooks in all four corners to tie down whatever I put in there. Uh, this thing here, this top is a very positive latching top. It will not come off by no means unless you're wanting it to come off. So at that point, I just need to run the bungee cords over it through the handles and it keeps it in place. And again, those wheels just snap on. And it's real nice because it stores so flat. And what we do is we put stuff inside this container that we need to take camping. When we get there, we empty it, and then we just put it out and leave it on the trailer. Of course, this can be left out in the rain. It's not going to hurt anything. Um, the mopeds we usually cover up with a tarp, although those can handle quite a bit of rain too. And then you see it just hooks to the back. And I've got that set up on the transmission mount of the uh, back of the hub. It can handle quite a bit. And when I first got this, the way that I found out what it could handle was I put six cinder blocks in the back and I thought, you know, there's probably not going to be much more need for anything uh, than six cinder blocks. We haul ice with it and the best part about this is when we're camping at a state park or we're camping at a site or a campground that don't have a uh, septic uh, sewage at site, we just take our Blue Boy, which is about 20 gallons, I believe, and uh, I can put it in the back of this and take it up to the dump station without dragging it around with my truck, which is really nice. Let me go ahead and, uh, sure, let me fire that thing up and you can hear what it sounds like. All right, this one has been started the other day, so it should start relatively easy. I will take this one up the driveway. I got that trailer hooked to it, but we will still be able to see what it looks like. Let's go ahead and fly up the drive and come back. Right, so there you go uh, I appreciate you watching and we're gonna get some more moped related videos out there uh, mainly me cruising around on the moped I am going to add a camera mount to the moped and I'm going to show that to you but uh, I just wanted to show you what that trailer looks like and it's really nice it's nice to have and I'm glad that uh, we can take that camping and do all the hauling that we do with it uh, it saves on the uh, moped and Technically, is it legal? I'm not real sure because they said a moped uh, for it to be legally a moped. It doesn't say anything about trailers and it says that you can't have more than three wheels on the ground. Most law enforcement agencies don't really care that you're pulling a little trailer like that, especially on a slow moped. So, 
just wanted to share that with you and I appreciate you watching and stay tuned for more. Thanks. Bye.